Hello, welcome to Baker so, so today let's take a look at the Arcteris AL Combat shirt and the Quiet Precision G3 Combat shirt. So I have been using the Quiet for quite some time and the Arcteris, I just recently got it. I still have the tag and I haven't read this to the field yet. So I can't really do an afterthought comparison. So I'm just going to do a comparison in structure and some of the material. So let's start off with pricing. The Arcteris on retail on the official site is 289 US dollars. And the quiet is about, I think, and the quiet is 173, I think. Now let's start from the bottom. The center fabric material, I think the Arcteris is, is a bit softer than the quiet. The quiet feels a bit thicker and stiffer. And as for the sleeve, the adjustment on the Arcteris is by a button, so you get two buttons for adjusting the tightness. Whereas in the quiet, you get a velcro tab, and you can adjust any length that is along the velcro. So in terms of adjustment, I would say the quiet is a little bit better. As for those who likes to warp the sleeve, I think the Arteri is better because of the split sleeve design here. So as you're warming up, you're not tightening the overall size of the sleeve. So next up is the elbow pad. The Arteri, when I purchased this, it already came with a built-in elbow pad over here. And you can access this by going in the inner pocket from the inside. So the elbow pad on the Arteri is here. It's about the same as you, where your elbow should be. And on the quiet, the elbow pad goes in here and all the way up to here. So in quiet, you get a longer pad, but the padding is on here. And on the Arcteris, it's more on the elbow side. So to me, I think the Arcteris elbow pad placement is better. So going up the arm pocket, the Arcteris is a four inch by four inch has a four inch by four inch travel panels with a zipper pocket. And the pocket inside, you have three, four, five loops like this for you to latch on some of the items maybe like a pen, muddy tools or whatever and you can access the pocket sideways it's more convenient but there's also higher chance of the items falling off if you're accessing the items from the side as for the quiet it's a velcro panel flipping up on top and they have a divider so you can get items on the front and back but there's no loop inside to further latch on any items and there's also a little hole here as a pen pocket in terms of the arm pocket size, I would say the arteria is a little bit bigger. And next up is the collar. The collar is by button again, and on top there's a velcro. And I think this collar is more stiff than the quiet one. So the quiet collar can be adjusted by a zipper again, so it's more convenient. But at the same time, the collar here is not as stiff, so it's a bit more saggy. And the final difference, and also I think it's the biggest difference between the two, is the armpit area. On the quai, you get a fixed fiber in here, and on the arteries, you get a more elastic mesh fiber on the armpit area. And since it, and the excess fiber allows you to get more movement on the armpit, and whereas in the quai, when I'm trying to, let's say, lift my arms up, I would pull the shirt up a little bit. And also, as soon as I wear the Arteris, I can feel the breeze in my armpits. So for those of you who like to stay cool, I think the Arteris could be a better option. Now, in terms of durability, I can't really say since I just recently got this. But from what I've read on the forums, people who work quite on duty usually last them about 9 to 30 months. And the Arteris is a little bit shorter. But for us as softers, I think if we have a game every week, it will be a difference between maybe 3 or 4 years. So it's not really that much of a difference. And I do think the Arteris will get worn off faster because of the softer fabric and the mesh net fabric in here. But on the nylon fabric, I think they're pretty much the same. They're both the those no melt, no drip, wire resistant nylon fabric, nylon cotton fabric. And on the chest area, the Arteris has a little bit more multi-cam fabric than the Quiet. So to sum up the two, the pros on the Arteris is that the sleeve design is good for those who would like to wear the sleeve and you get a zipper arm pocket and a mesh net fabric on the armpit area and also the elbow pad placement. As for Quiet, it's good for those of you who do not like to wear the sleeve to get a better flexible adjustment on the sleeve and also the adjustment with the zipper on top is more convenient. But just a quick note that the Arteris also have the LT version. LT stands for lightweight. 
and it's for hotter areas and the LT version they have a zipper on the corner area but I think the G3 and the AL is pretty much in the same class the LT will probably match with the quite hot weather series of the uniform I'll see later on if I can borrow a LT Arteris for my friend to do another comparison between the AL and the LT so this is it for the quick comparison between the Quai Precision Gen 3 Combat Shirts and the Arteris AL Combat Shirts. Everyone please stay safe and I will see you guys next time.